Dutch Hulk Smash here. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we will be covering Marvel Spider-Man 2. If you like this video, go ahead and Hulk Smash that like button, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for future videos. Next mission up, Healing the World. Harry wants to give me a tour of his new lab, and knowing him the way I do, he's going to try to get me to join him. If only he knew what my other job was. Welcome. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place, right? Is amazing. Have it a little more over the top than I would have liked. Yeah. How did you? you got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, this place is I made insane. A few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission to heal the world. Wow. That's money may have gotten the ball rolling. My job is to put it to work, making the world a better place. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees, or to be more precise, on bee predators. Here, follow me. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? Yep. You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. The carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? Yes, I do. Bee drone. Whoa, this is cool. Oh, uh, that's cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, oh, there's one right there. Wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. You see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not hurt them. Oh, oh nice! Yes! Check the hive. Nice. You're done, Peter. A very productive session. Uh -huh. We got great data. Okay, flying home. Welcome to entomology. That was fun. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Uh, any chance I can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. Oh, We've actually Dr. Met. Connors. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. He's the one that becomes a lizard. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. 
I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. That's what he just said. Yeah, believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call. But, uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. Okay, should we explore or should we go upstairs? So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone okay. to have Dr. Connors here. Explore the Emily Mead Foundation. The origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non-biological chemical compounds? Recent discoveries of meteorites containing organic molecules considered the building blocks of life may provide a potent clue. Okay. Asteroids, meteoroids, meteors, and meteorites. I think we should invoke his PhD. Oh, let's go over the computer. So sorry. Yes, yeah, so sorry. So much to see here. Where do I even start? This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. Yeah, it is. This would have been crime scene evidence. I wonder how it ended up here. Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. Yeah. The need for medical organ transplants far outnumbers available donors. An innovative solution uses 3D printing technology to create custom replacement organs. Okay. Welcome to entomology. Beehives show complex group decision making and group locomotion. Subscribe! Swarming is an annual process in which the colony expands and splits. Need some help? Drones. Yeah, uh, doing a little cross collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultra light drones using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will, by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. Okay. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. All right, I'm on Harry. my way. I'll see you in a sec. Hey, what are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra-efficient batteries, charged by bicycles. These bikes? Can I ride them? Not right now, oh, but when man. they're road ready, we'll need people to test them. Nice. I'll try to come back. Okay, so no bike ride for us. Beedrome testing will be taking place in the atrium throughout the day. So please, be aware. Cool feed the fish. fish. Not just fish, research subjects. Want to feed them? Yes. Yeah? Japanese koi fish have well-studied pigmentation variation, which is ideal for our research into enhanced reflectivity. Stacks of intracellular anhydrous guanine crystals. Separated by cytoplasm, we're finding it very useful for eco-friendly roofing materials. So cool! Okay, should we head upstairs now? So Man, much exploring to do. Oh wait, he's over here. Let's go this way. Let's go upstairs. Fun time's over, Peter. Come on. Time to work. I know. Did you hear about Roger? Sick? Oh, what happened to Roger? Interesting. Roger, Roger. You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but... We'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. 
amazing, spectacular. What do I Where know? Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your Continue energy seems really good, the Harry. Tour. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Think Even back. Even before high school. To middle school. Okay. Middle school. Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. What's the Sorry, intel, Sorry, it's Miles? just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? I yes, did. that was so great. Interesting research project. And lowers the old cortisol levels, too. Right? I honestly think it's one of my favorite spots in the building. This way, dude. This way, dude. Da -da. I'm hiding. You can't see me. I'm invisible, Parker. See, look, can't even see me. Oh, you spotted me. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Yes. Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions, mize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. okay. Match Let's the base pairs to incorporate out. as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Okay, so you gotta try to match those up. Looks like, right? So, we'll try this. Interesting. This, maybe? And then here? I think? Cool. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Right. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations right. patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. Closer to feeding the world. Okay. Nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. So I have to have one of those. One of these and one of these. So.
Okay. Let's try this one. Work, Peter. There you go. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow! I know a rooftop you could use for a real-world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. Head to the office. Commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. Your office. The Batmobile. Oh. Our office. Harry. Now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet. Not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I... Put it. Uh -oh, Don't tell me it. you lost it. Nope, false alarm. <laughs> right here. Gotcha. Oh, hide real quick. Let's see if he notices me. Come on. I'm so excited for you to see this. Oh. Okay, okay. Come on. Go ahead. Swipe. Doesn't work. Access denied. Wow. That's a cool office. Man. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. That's cool. You join me? There's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> well, of course. Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> yeah. Oh, one quick thing. <laughs> Yay! Welcome, Peter. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Yeah. But Coney Island later, yeah? <laughs> you bet. <laughs> all right. I like that mission. Oh, hey, I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the location, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Healing the world mission is now complete. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, oh. but I was... Sorry. I just got a new job. Hold that, hold For off. Real? Miles is talking to me. That's awesome. Where's it at? 
This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on, don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, oh. but... duty calls. Trust me, your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. Thank you. All right, with the mission complete, that'll wrap up this video. Thanks for watching. Until next time, have a smashing day.